Right now is one of the busiest times for the Honeycomb Project and their uh, Chicago's go-to nonprofit for family volunteering by inspiring young people to give back. We are joined by co-founder Christina Lowenstein and volunteer Aiden Chung to chat about their season of service that runs from now until New Year's Day. Guys, thanks for being here. Yeah, of course. Thank you for having us. Yeah, yeah so you. Christina, how did you decide to start this? I feel like so often you hear people talking about, I want to give back, but I don't know how. Why did you decide to start the Honeycomb Project? That's exactly what happened. Um, every year at the Honeycomb Project around the holidays, lots of families reach out to us. They want to get involved. They really want to help their kids um, celebrate the season with service. And so we really decided to ramp up our efforts during the holiday season from Thanksgiving to New Year's. So no matter what interest you have, what age your kids are, um, where you live, that we really have a variety of opportunities all throughout the city for parents and kids to give back. OK, so Christina, what are some of the activities that families can get involved with? Yeah, so like I said, um, we tackle a lot of you know challenging issues facing our city, mm -hmm. everything from housing and food insecurity to uh, helping families get basic needs, um, environmental conservation, um, but really hands-on fun projects uh, that are meaningful. Uh, so everything from preparing meals at shelters, um, helping migrant families get coats and warm winter items, uh, big environmental stewardship projects out in the nature preserves, uh, you name it. That is wow. such a wide range. I love it. And Aiden, yeah. what did you see that you were like, I want to get involved with this? And what was your first volunteer project? Because I know you're one of the volunteers. Yeah, so I started volunteering with Honeycomb when I was eight years old. What? Um, yeah, yeah, crazy. Uh, and my first project was a uh, food pantry up in Ravenswood, which was so much fun. Uh, and I just thought that being able to, to give back, especially as a family, was really, was really cool and something that I hadn't been able to do before. So uh, just being able to spend time with family, get to know other families who wanted to do things like that, it was just, uh, and it, ha it has been an, uh, a very memorable experience. Well, I mean, I think both of you can answer this. Um, how much of a time commitment is it? I think a lot of people think, oh my goodness, I'm so busy as, as it is. I do want to give back, but I just don't know if I can commit for the long term a certain amount of time. Yeah, it really doesn't feel like a time commitment to me, I think, mm -hmm. because I have so much fun while I'm doing it. I, I, through the organization, I've made so many friends, so now we all can, you know, get together and do projects together. Right. Um, and you just made me and everybody else <laughs> that doesn't have enough time feel terrible about ourselves. No, 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 Get no. with it, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, it's, 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 an, it's an amazing way to just spend time with your friends, your family, okay. do something that's impactful. Yeah. So, yeah. Right. And what is right now underway is the season of service. Can you talk to us about that, Christina? Yeah, well, I'm a busy mom, too, so yeah. I know how challenging it can be to kind yeah. of plan these things. So what Honeycomb really does is plan all of the aspects of these programs. So we want your family to mm -hmm. come and for folks like Aiden to come show up, have a great time along with their parents. Uh, and so, you know, like I said, this um, kicks off uh, actually tomorrow. Um, and we have, you know, just all of these projects and communities throughout the city. So. Yeah. Well, tell us specifically, there's something called the Cheer Challenge, too? That is our big signature event okay. of the holiday season. Um, it happens in downtown Chicago, December 17th from 2 to 5 p.m. Uh, it is an incredible event. Um, uh, Aiden actually was the MC our very first year, which was during COVID. And um, we were just so inspired watching all of these families come out and just spread joy and cheer and help our neighbors. It's an annual tradition. And so um, it is the city's largest celebration of service that happens during the holiday season. And we are expecting hundreds of people to come out downtown on December 17th. And Aiden is actually um, emceeing the event this year along right with another teen, uh, teen volunteer. That is awesome. You guys, if you want to learn more about how you can take part in the volunteer opportunities, including the one just mentioned here and the Holiday Cheer Challenge, the Honeycomb Project's website, thehoneycombproject.org, is right there on your screen or you can head to their socials also shown those. Christina, Aiden, thanks for being here. Yeah, thank you. Thanks for having us.